University Tunku Abdul Rahman, Utah is a dynamic university with four thriving campuses which are located in Petaling Jaya, Kuala Lumpur, Bandar Sungai Long and Kampa Perak. Guided by its vision, Utah has made impressive strides in establishing a strong reputation as a comprehensive university with dedication to achieving excellence in teaching and research. In 2004, the Institute of Postgraduate Studies and Research, also known as IPSR, was established by the university. IPSR's functions are managing the university's research grant applications and utilization, facilitating research and development activities among the research centers, as well as administering the university's postgraduate programs. IPSR also acts as a central resource for researchers to obtain information on related research funding, regulatory and legal requirements for external grant application, publications, external university events and much more. Driven towards transforming Utah into a research university, in collaboration with the Department of Consultancy and Commercialization DCC, IPSR have constantly promote research among students and academics, establish and source for research grant, set up research centers, produce postgraduate students, expand research facilities, sustain network with external parties, and conduct consultancy and commercialization work. Today, there are 27 research centers firmly established in specific areas of research to encourage multidisciplinary collaborations to leverage on members' expertise and strengths, to share expertise between public and private sectors, and also to provide training opportunities for students. The Mingnan Cultural Study Research Project in Utah is a platform for academic exchange and a knowledge bank in Minnan study which will help to enrich and foster better relationship and understanding among diverse ethnic community in China, Taiwan and Southeast Asia. The research that I'm doing is on uh, police media relations, uh, strategies in enhancing communication efficacy. The study hopefully will encourage both parties to understand how each other works and hopefully encourage them to practice communications and uh, eventually have better relationship, relationships with each other. For our project, we really want to bring a benefit to the young generation, to bring awareness how important is a local culture for them. We try to use 3D uh, conversion, uh, 360 panoramic and also VR walkthrough. So that everything, we hope that one day we can combine to become an app. We are trying to use a comp computational electromagnetics uh, to be applied in microwave remote sensing so that we can use this method to study how microwave uh, emitted from the uh, satellites uh, interact with the Earth terrain so that we can actually interpret the satellite images more accurately uh, for the user community uh, in tropical countries and in the world. Actually, we are the first project successfully implemented the multi-factor identifications. So meaning we merge or we marriage the fingerprint, which is the biometric, with the cryptography. Our aims is actually want to make all the whole information community become more secure. The most important thing about this research is that we are able to develop a model in a computer that is able to learn like human, okay? Now this computer will be able to learn to classify objects, whether it's actually to distinguish between male or female, or to classify different type of vehicles, not only vehicle, but how many trucks, how many buses, how many passengers' cars, how many taxis actually passing by this particular road. BCI wheelchair, which is the brain computer interface wheelchair, it has a communications module as well as a, a mobility module which enables the patients to pick and choose which location they want to go. So the wheelchair will improve the quality of life. We are 
here to design a system for the building of the wall envelope so that we cut off the heat from the sun whereby the room can maintain at a lower temperature and in, in due course, we cut down on the electricity necessary for the air conditioning. For the civil engineering, whereby this system can be used uh, on, the, on land to deal with the soft ground, how to build construction, heavy construction especially, over the soft ground. This project, uh, we designed it to generate power. We can design, use this one for either a power plant or we can also use for the domestic uh, usage with those uh, very big mansion. Uh, they can use this one for the power generation and also the produce of hot water. We are trying to increase the use of renewable energy on the distribution network. So we use this uh, active management system to solve the power quality issue so that the utility network can continue to operate their network effectively and customers will not suffer their uh, equipment interruptions. In our research, we actually use uh, alternative materials to replace the portion of fish meal in our ingredient. This can help to reduce the actual, uh, the, the final production cost of our feed. We also uh, contribute to the sustainability of the uh, Malaysian economy. In Malaysia, we have a very unique multicultural background and linguistic identity is normally subsumed within cultural identity. So we are looking at the use of poetry writing as a means of self-expression in, in terms of developing linguistic identities. Last year, we took the effort to compile the findings of 23 surveys. We published a report to disseminate and share the findings with those interested in youth-related studies. So far, we have conducted more than 40 surveys online to explore youth interests perceptions and attitude on various topics and it provides a platform for researchers to collect data for youth profiling study in Malaysia. The benefit of our research project, first I think is, is uh, to build up our own herbal garden for our bachelor program and the second uh, is used for the uh, future research purpose and the third uh, we try to find out some uh, value uh, uh, local herbs and then try to commer uh, commercialize in Malaysia or even overseas. This is the first study that we would like to report on the isolation of Borneo from D. aromatica in Malaysia. In this study, we successfully developed an extraction method to isolate Borneo from the essential oil, the azulate of this plant, D. aromatica, in Malaysia. Our research pro project concerns uh, the, pro the generation of induced pluripotent stem cells. IPSC is used in a regenerative medicine to repair our damaged organs or tissues. So, so that is the whole benefit of, of uh, developing IPSC for regenerative medicine. My research is about biodiversity of fungi from the freshwater ecosystem. These fungi in the natural environment, they are decomposers. I isolate the fungi, I grow them in culture. So potentially, maybe I can find certain important or new compounds such as antibiotics, so the enzymes, certain proteins, which can be very helpful uh, for our human welfare. My project is about palm oil wastewater treatment. So this type of wastewater contains a high pollutants, high concentration of pollutants. The final uh, system will be membrane bioreactor. So this system will make sure the treated water will be uh, direct, can produce direct clean water and particle free. Uh, wireless sensor networks have been widely used in um, many areas to monitor the environment uh, without the attendance of a human being. So in this project, we try to come up with some solutions to extend the lifetime of the wireless sensor network. In the meantime, we also need to preserve certain uh, reliability of the uh, uh, data transmissions. We hope that it will benefit the farmers. Um, they can monitor, use the wine sensor networks to monitor their paddy fields uh, as long as they want in order to know what is happening in the uh, paddy fields. The project is essentially to find out what are the fruit flies in this C4 land that we have. So we are developing a catalogue of all the fruit flies that are found in this C4 land. So what we are doing is we are actually gathering enough information about what fruits are attacked, how they do to manage them and uh, therefore we, uh, we help the farmers. In the end. This project is about teenage depression. Previously, about depression is always we use a medical model. We include the psychosocial factors into the depression model 
of recover, recovery model. So it will be beneficial for the society educator and policy maker. Now the study investigates whether the Japanese HRM practices in Malaysia is at the declining stage and are they moving towards the American HRM model as a source of inspiration. Hence, they should be flexible and not over to introduce their country of origin practices. Over the years, the increasing number of publications, citations, as well as the cumulative impact factor for journal articles by Utah researchers accepted by Scopus and Thomson Reuters Web of Science database is reflective of the immense expansion and contribution of IPSR. Many Utah researchers have achieved prominence and won awards both local and international over the years. Two of our inventors won the World Inventor Award in Seoul, Korea, while many more have obtained international recognition and achievements in their respective fields of research. Many research project outcomes at Utah have also been patented and commercialized. Products such as the membrane-encased aerated lightweight concrete block and the Japanese moss ball, the Marimo, are prominent inventions already applicable in the industry. In 2005, the Utah Research Fund, also known as Utah RF, was set up as an internal research grant scheme designed to provide seed funding to support Utah researchers and students in implementing research projects and research-related activities. The cumulative total amount of allocation up to 2013 is 23 million ringgit. Over the years, Utah researchers garnered external research funds up to 25.8 million ringgit. Utah has more than 150 local and international partners where collaborations in research and training provide even more opportunities for research initiatives. Utah's progressive research drive has been affirmed by a winning record in securing competitive research grants. The university has been receiving funds from various industrial organizations, government and non-governmental agencies, foundations, corporate companies and partner universities. IPSR will continue to progress with even more emphasis on research among students and staff in collaboration with industry partners and government agencies towards greater environmental awareness, sustainability and a greener and better world. Music